So let us not look at how we can actually create uh, different kinds of web links in our web page. Uh, there are basically three that I'm going to show you today. Okay, um, the first one being uh, external web link, like this particular one, DreamWorks Pictures. Okay, when I click on DreamWorks Pictures, it will bring me to an external website that is not uh, stored within my own web uh, domain. All right, the second kind of link is actually a mail to link. Uh, and uh, this one allows the users of your web page to um, send emails, compose emails okay, to relevant parties. And when, I, when the user clicks on that mail to link, it will actually open up the default email client of that user, that client, and he'll be able to compose an email and sending it to you the relevant skill set. Okay, and the third kind of link is what we call an internal link. Okay. And like here, I have actually attached an internal link to the image uh, of the cast. Okay, when the user actually clicks on the image, it will bring uh, the user to uh, one of the internal web pages that you have created within your website. First and foremost, let us first create our external link. Select DreamWorks Pictures. Okay, and in the link text box, I'm going to type in the URL of DreamWorks. Okay, that's done. So that's my external link. And if I preview in my Internet Explorer, check. And I click on DreamWorks Pictures. That will actually bring me to DreamWorks desktop. Next, we are going to create the mail to link, okay, creating an email okay, to the uh, web administrator. So select web administrator, type in, in the link text box mail to, and the you are the email address of the web administrator. Okay, say I'm the web administrator, so that's done. And the last kind of link that I'm going to create is actually the internal web links, which links me to other pages within my own website. So uh, I'm going to click on the image. Okay, this is the image. When the user clicks the image, he will be brought to, um, for instance, the characters page. So I'm going to uh, use the pointer here to drag. Okay, I'm going to select characters.html, and you notice that uh, that is in populated for me directly. Okay, I'm going to save the page and preview in Internet Explorer to test that it works. Okay, when I click on the image, it should bring me to characters.html, okay, which was created earlier. 